team take the key takeaways of the G20 report? Yeah, we um, explored um, how India should move ahead in the coming years, particularly from uh, an economic empowerment uh, perspective for its population, as well as to meet the environment and sustainability goals that India has committed to between now and 2070 of being a net zero. We actually went with a 2050 goal uh, based on the Paris Agreement of keeping the uh, global uh, temperatures uh, only at 1.5 degrees above the pre-industrial levels. Um, with those uh, two goals, uh, what we really looked at is uh, what's the real agenda for the next 10 years because this is where we have to provide escape velocity uh, to these two goals of economic empowerment uh, to our population as well as to meet the sustainability goals. And I think the summary of the research is that uh, in the next uh, 10 years we could get to a point where a large part of our billion uh, population that is today below the empowerment line, empowerment line defined as uh, $12 PPP per capita uh, per day income, uh, that's about 300 rupees uh, per day, um, <clears throat> which is a higher bar, which is a more stringent bar compared to the uh, World Bank uh, poverty definition of $2.15 a day. But nevertheless, this gives people a shot uh, to social mobility. And we think a large part of that population could go beyond the empowerment line, could rise above the empowerment line. And then the other goal is, can we keep half our uh, carbon emission intensity um, as, as part of our GDP, as a fraction of our GDP. And collectively, our research tells us that it'll take about $11 trillion of additional capital spending uh, to meet these uh, twin goals. Um, the way out is that a large part of this uh, distance could be traveled uh, on the back of uh, macroeconomic growth, uh, growth in GDP per capita, growth in businesses, because that helps put money on the table. Uh, and the other aspect is uh, innovation, both business innovation and technology innovation, uh, which makes more and more technologies get into, into the money, uh, business cases start working. Um, <clears throat> but equally the innovation, particularly digital innovation, um, that uh, leads to uh, much more accessibility uh, of the economic gains to the broader population.